Back again with some more Zoom stuff. This one is the mid-size brush hog. So this one came out uh, same time as that Magnum UV Cry I did in the other video. Uh, iCast 2020, uh, I believe, was their debut. Even though iCast really doesn't, I guess it's going to be online only this year. But this is it. So the mid-size. Um, I know a bunch of buddies, you know, we've all been talking about this one for a while. Trying to get one that is bigger than that mini or the baby brush hog that they have but not as big as the regular so i just want to show you a little size comparison so this is the new one really good size looks like for flipping i wish this part was a little little bit beefier but it'll be all right uh lengthwise uh, the main body looks like it's a four inch bait and then with the the brush hog tails you're talking maybe five inch so comparing that to let's see here this is the mini or the baby so that's that one and then your standard which is a pretty big bait in comparison but yeah, right there, I don't know if you can see it. So there's your size comparison. Uh, the middle one's the new one for this year, which will be, I think, a really good bait for, for flipping. And I've always liked to, to use the baby as a jig trailer or Carolina rig. Um, this one, I mean, I primarily fish for smallmouth, so I think these two sizes will be better. But I mean, this one, whenever I used to live in Texas, used to be the deal, but you know, I'm not around seven, eight, nine, 10 pound bass that much anymore. So these guys definitely flip or Carolina rig this. And uh, I don't know. I mean, this mini one, it might just go to the wayside. I think this size is going to be better as just an all around bait, small mouth and large mouth really. But anyways, just wanted to do a video, show you the size comparison and we'll see uh, what else cool comes out at ICAST this year.